Hello, my name is Ben Howe. I'm one of the product specialists here at Charles Gavis Ford. And in today's video, we're going to talk about Sinks 3 Android Auto System for the Android users. Now with Android Auto, when you first connect it, you gotta download the Android Auto app and actually what it'll do, it'll ask you to go through some menus. Uh, those menus will actually download your phone to the Sync 3 system. So even if you're not connected via USB, which you do have to be to use Android Auto, your phone will still have all the Bluetooth features like making phone calls, playing Bluetooth audio, um, and other sources like that. But now getting to the Sync 3 with Android Auto system, this is your main screen. So once you get through all the setup, this is what you're gonna see. This menu here kind of has a shortcut. So when it says 16 minutes to home, it kind of goes to the most destinations you travel the most. So when it says 16 minutes to home, they know that we travel from work to home and then vice versa, if you are at home, I'll say from home to work and kind of give you the nice time to get there. You also got the temperature here for Des Moines uh, and then some other attractions around town as well. Uh, down here, the little tabs down here is all your little icons. So your maps is the first one here on the bottom left that's going to bring up your Google Maps, which Google Maps is awesome. It's going to constantly update for you and keep uh, keep all the maps fresh for you, even during road construction and stuff like that. So right now, you can also search for destinations as well by hitting the Google Voice, so we can click it. Where is the nearest gas station? Showing results for where is the nearest gas station. And so it actually pulls it all up right here. You can see A, B, and C. Uh, it shows what type of gas station they are relatively how much the gas is so you can pick the cheapest gas in town which is always helpful next is going to be your phone so in here in the phone you got all your contacts that pop up you also have the phone menu you can go to voicemail you can dial a number you can see the calls missed all those good things right there hit back then our home button takes us back now if you always want to make a call via bluetooth you can just click the the microphone and say call steve or call john however you have it written in your phone that's how you say it to the car uh, next is going to be our music. So with music and Android Auto, you've got a couple different sources. If you have Pandora, those stuff downloaded, those will pop up here as well. Uh, with this current device, we got Google Play and Spotify. So we can pick from any of those media sources as well. Now, if you'd like to jump back to the Sync 3 screen, we hit the bottom right button. It asks us to return to Sync. And now we're back to our Sync 3 main screen. Now from here, we can access the climate. We can access Sirius XM to the audio. Uh, now, however, when you do hook up through Android Auto, it does get rid of your vehicle's navigation and puts in the Google Maps, which is really nice because Google Maps is fantastic. You can return to sync and have all your icons back there at the bottom. Thanks again for watching this video from everybody here at Charles Gavis Ford. If you would take a couple moments, please like and subscribe to the channel. We're always updating with more content as it comes out from Ford. Stay tuned. Thanks.